Welcome guys to Lennox Bennett channel. Today we're looking at statistics worksheet. If you are not subscribed, please ensure you hit the subscribe button. No, pause. All right, I'm going to pause and hit the subscribe button. All right, thank you. Just go ahead and like the video. All right, thank you. Let's go. So it says a class of 30. Oh, please ensure that your notification bell is turned on so you can get the notification whenever I go what, what, um, Live, right? So, a class of 30 students counted the number of books in their bags on a certain day. The number of books in each bag is shown below. So, what we're going to do, we're going to look at the tally. All right, we're going to get it on this. So, now, why is not going to be in All right, so it says a class of 30 students, and this is basically the table. It says copy and complete the table. So what we're going to do first, notice what they do, or what they did, rather. So what they did was, they kind of did it for us, show you. So the ones, two ones, right? See? And then they show you, so it should be two times one. So you know, if you never know, you know, must pick up that. And then this will be three times two, which is four. They got the six. So we're gonna do the same thing. So for trees, let's see, row by row, one, two, three, four, five. So that's a total of five. So let's go. So five multiplied by three that gives us fifty. We'll do the same for four now. One, two, three, four, five, six, fours. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And again, six times four, that should give us 24. It's very easy. Let's go again. And for five now, let's put them one. Number of files to so represent the tally and then the frequency. And then we're going to say 7 times 5, which is 25. All right, let's proceed. We move to the 6 now. 6 is really what say in Jamaica. So we're going to say 6. So there are no answer. So we have 1. And four sixes, all right. So let's go. So we have one, two, three, four sixes. So we how we do now multiply the frequency times this so four six twenty four. So we're doing on nicely. We are at seven now, and then we will find. Let's see how many sevens. Uh, why feel like my report? Oh, let's see two. So we have one. That's it. All right, so that's three sevens. All right, so guys, listen to me carefully. You see, for the frequency, we have to add up the frequency and see if we, how much we get. They told us it was 30. In some cases, they won't tell you the frequency. So let's add this and see if we get 30. 3 plus 4 is 7, 7 plus 7, 14 plus 6, 20, 25, 28, 30. So it's correct. And we're going to get this now, which is 3 times 7, 21. We will need to total this, depending on if they ask the mean. Let me see. Yeah, they did ask for the mean, so we have to total this, all right? Which is the F of it. You see, this represents the total books. All right, let's go. So, I'll just punch it in a calculator since this is a paper to me. All right, all right, 
welcome back guys welcome back you know we have to do the work all right let's go i'm gonna use the calculator so it's two it's gonna use the calculator for time two plus six that's eight plus 15 that's 23 plus 24 that's 47 plus 35 82 so 24 plus 24 that's 106 plus 24 127 all right so the total number of books is 127 let's see what they are they say state the modal number of books in the bag state the modal of books in the bag of the sample of students so the mode would be the highest frequency let's see three four seven so seven is the highest but it represents five all right so remember seven persons what well, i read is seven persons had five books only two persons persons had one book three persons had two books. so that's all you read it so it would be five for the answer not the seven but the five all right it says using the table in A above or otherwise, calculate the total number of books. Oh, we did that already. So this was 127. And then they say calculate the mean. So that would be 127 divided by 30. All right, so four times that our 120. So it's actually four books. I can have four points of books, so I'm going to round it down to four books only. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll come to the end. Um, like for part two, I will be doing this one. This one is very similar to that one. I'll be doing this, but another time, all right? I will meet you now. So, guys, please ensure you are subscribed so you can see the solution for this one, all right? And these are all past people questions. See what it says. It says state the law of only for the class interval 2029. Using the scale of 120 centimeters to the x axis represent 5 meters and that. Draw the histogram, illustrate the diagram, and then determine the number of students who threw the ball. Distance recorded as 50 meters or more. Alright, so guys, um, please ensure that you are subscribed. Please ensure that you like the video. This is the last one. It's a mouth, no doubt. Thanks for watching, guys. Please ensure you like the video also. I'm out, I'm out. See you guys.